It's time for Cruise News, the latest cruise news throughout the world. So sit back and relax and enjoy Cruise News. Hello and welcome to Cruise News. What a week we've had in the cruise industry this week. Here are the top news stories. Princess Cruises two base UK ships, the Sky Princess and Regal Princess, will be celebrating the crowning of King Charles III next month with live coverage of the coronation service on both ships Jumbotron. Guests will also be treated to a royal afternoon tea with Victoria sponge cake, fish and chips, sausage rolls, and truffle. Other special events include guest speaker Grant Harold, a farmer butler of the king. Both ships' piazza areas will be decorated in royal colors, while guests can wear royal red, white, and blue uh, for the evening. Cape Liberty Cruise Port in New York will have a parking increase. Effective May 1, 2023, the new parking rate will be $30 a day. The Norwegian Bliss cruise ship started the Port of Seattle's 2023 cruise season recently with a seven-night round-trip cruise to Alaska. The port is anticipating this cruise season to contribute over $900 million in economic activity, supporting 5,500 jobs, as well as producing $14.5 million in taxes. Each ship that calls Seattle its home port is expected to add $4 million to the economy. Popular Alaskan Skagway port has a large rock formation high above the dock that could pose a risk to larger cruise ships and are therefore making scheduled changes for shorter port times to share dock facilities. In 2022, a series of rock slides occurred in the same area of the rock formation. Cruise lines are concerned, but Skagway port is still on their itineraries. Norwegian Pearl cruise ship will have a special world's greatest classic rock cruise on April 5th through the 10th, 2024, titled New Horizons, departing Miami, Florida, of, with Porta Plata, Dominican Republic, and Nassau, Bahamas on its itinerary. There will be 25 different artists performing, including the Zombies, Alan Parsons, the young double liners, and more. Royal Caribbean is exploring the possibility of expanding its presence in the Bahamas by considering Rum Cay as a potential new location. Rum Cay is a small island in the southern region of the Bahamas that is known for its beautiful beaches, turquoise waters, and natural beauty. The cruise industry in nine St. Lawrence ports in Montreal and Quebec are returning to pre-pandemic levels. This year, the ports are expecting 460,000 passengers compared to 266,601 passengers last year. The Nassau Bahamas Cruise Port's $300 million project nears completion. Cruise ship passengers will be welcomed to a huge area of new and improved facilities with the grand opening happening the last weekend of May. Holland America Line announced that Seattle resident Austin Thomas is the winner of the 150th anniversary poster design contest. (music) 
The port of Kiel in Germany announced that it's expecting a total of 221 cruise calls this year. The port is also investing in expanding the shore power infrastructure. Ports of Stockholm, Sweden are expecting a busy 2023 cruise season with 125 cruise ships between now and October. Princess Cruises is ready for a big 2023 Alaska season with seven cruise ships sailing 14 cruise itineraries including the Discovery Princess, Royal Princess, Ruby Princess, Majestic Princess, Grand Princess, Crown Princess, and Sapphire Princess. Princess Cruises Island Princess ship is gearing up for a worldwide adventure starting on January 4, 2024. Sailing round trip from Fort Lauderdale, Florida, the ship will visit 51 destinations in 27 countries and six continents. Explorer Journeys announced that Explorer One ship has successfully completed sea trials and will undergo final preparations for their inaugural voyage in July 2023. MSC World Europa, uh, MSC Cruises' biggest and most environmentally advanced cruise ship, has arrived in Europe to begin its summer season in the Mediterranean Sea. SICK is introducing MSR 6000 sensors for man overboard detection system designed to help detect and rescue a missing person from a cruise ship. This detection system can help locate the exact position of a missing person quickly, which is critical for a successful rescue operation. Thank you for tuning in to Cruise News. Until next time, happy cruising!